Hello and welcome back to Shattered Memories, where <laughs> things exist. And also, um, uh, so for the first few episodes, Tom, I, um, Cheryl, sweetie, there is an issue Damn. where, um, <laughs> <clears throat> so the phone information by default oh my God, comes you from what? <laughs> the phone is ringing. Oh. <laughs> Am I right? Are there any, are there any spooks? I don't see the <laughs> so I guess we're good. <laughs> do you count telemarketers as spooks? Because I, I do. I do. absolutely <laughs> do. Nothing uh, <laughs> scarier. That's objective. That's not. That's not my opinion. That's just. That's just the way things are. <laughs> All right. So, um. Shit. So, by default, when you call things or when you're hunting echoes. The sound comes out the Wiimote speaker, which is really cool when you're playing the game, but really bad when you're recording the game. And, uh, I didn't find the setting to change that until the game-breaking glitch, so we're gonna, we're gonna be stuck with that for a few parts. Just a little this this game breaking glitch better shatter this fucking shattered memories game for how I much mean, time you're giving it. <laughs> I mean, I was very upset and I spent a while trying to just force force it back. But no. Alas, nothing would work. Besides completely restarting the game that I hadn't saved. Cause I forgot that it doesn't actually autosave. It does Really? I was too used to modern games. I had become spoiled. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> soundtrack of things. So, are the set pieces similar in this game as well? Like, are we gonna go down a hallway or something? There's no random never. hallway we'll with a wheelchair in, in it. Ryan. <laughs> okay, gotcha, gotcha. And we're not we expecting hallways. We definitely don't find a, hall, a wheelchair in the school and proclaim that it's insane <laughs> for it to be there. <laughs> well, that is an insane thing to happen. I hope we don't see that. <laughs> anyway, now we got a spook photo. Not that oh, we can geez. hear it, but it's fine. <laughs> well, that's why. What? We'll never know. <laughs> I just thought this bear looked particularly suspicious. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I had to turn my, my record. Okay, so in Audacity, there was like a lot of noise coming through, and I couldn't figure out why I, until I realized the recording volume was all the way up. <laughs> Uh, that would do it. Yeah, that does it. <laughs> Wait, what? That, I said that, that, that would do it. it. <laughs> yeah. It wasn't like that last part. I was using, um... I was using a different microphone and the settings reset when I switched them. Ah, uh, yes. These things happen. Also, do you like backtracking? <laughs> no. Sometimes it depends. Well, at least this time there's some slightly different things happening. Uh, slightly. Is it always winter in these Silent Hill games? Like, invariably? <laughs> what? What? Is it always winter in Silent Hill games? No. <laughs> no. That's, just... that's unique to this one for some reason. Wasn't the last one also a winter, though? <laughs> it was Ash. Ash. No, it wasn't. I... <laughs> no, the first Silent Hill, um, it's not winter, but it's snowing. Yeah. I don't Where know why the text is winter, cut but... off. No, they, the characters talk about how weird it is that it's snowing. Oh, uh, okay. It's part of the what the fuck. I see. Um, All right. that moment when you confuse movie canon and game canon... 
Wait, what did you confuse? <laughs> the ash! Oh, yeah, no, that was... Yeah, they changed that for the movie. Yeah. You know what? Part of the reason why I hate the movie is because it does so much to try and explain what Silent Hill is when that's not really the draw of the series. I think one of the things that bugs me, at least based on Phalus's dissection of it, is the, uh... Shit. Uh, the fact that aesthetically they were so close and they, like, could have made it work ex if they weren't stupid about shit. <laughs> like well, the, I mean, like Ariel, the... you gotta remember, this is the same director that turned Harry's character into a woman because he thought a man couldn't yes. be that attached to and their And then child. they had to add a man <laughs> character. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I wonder. <laughs> I wonder where a male character could have come from. <laughs> Cheryl? Cheryl? Oh, yeah, she I did this for parts that Sweet. were exactly the same. You okay? Are you at home? <laughs> Sweetie? Oh, because yeah. it comes out of your Wii mode, that's right. Yes. You can't find them. What? Is somebody with you? Cheryl? I'm coming to get no, you. You're not. Damn it. So is she gonna die like the last one? Um. I mean, oh Ryan, gosh. we're not gonna just spoil it. Look, well, you said the. No, there's a reason we said that the timeline literally can't be the same in this game. Alright. <laughs> and it's not because Silent Hill just got frozen over. Yeah, no, this is temporary, <laughs> believe it or not. Uh, and I know this is another thing about this being on the Wii that's kind of crazy, is that this change happens in real time. Yeah, no, like, there's a lot of things this game does that's super cool from, like, a mechanics or a, a, a technical aspect. But then, <laughs> there's the, the bad parts of the mechanics. <laughs> oh no, this game definitely has... It's problems, but I feel like the positives definitely outweigh the negatives on this one. Oh, I think it gets Especially close. when you consider this game, the devs that made this the ones behind Origins and Homecoming. Like, I tech- like, I love a lot of shit this game does. If the hospital nightmare section was skippable, I would <laughs> praise this game a lot more. <laughs> Yeah, the because hospitals. Because that just, it's is just the one literally boring. the worst. <laughs> <laughs> the worst part of this game, and potentially of any game. If I yeah, to, no, it's it's like, the worst part of like the entire series. It's that bad, Brian. Like, oh, if geez. I had to compare that to the hell that was fighting Olaf in Kingdom Hearts 3, <laughs> I think finding Olaf still wins. But it's fucking close. <laughs> <laughs> I know I've ranted about that before, where Goofy and Donald yeah. are incessantly being like, That look, sounds like Olaf! How are we supposed to find him? Oh, I hear Olaf! <laughs> Let's just establish, they all sound like Olaf! <laughs> like, literally incessant <laughs> in that section. And I'm like, oh my god, Bullshit. I'm literally in hell. <laughs> Why did they have to add Organization 13? I could have been done with this series years ago. <laughs> <sighs> Alright, here's yeah, the first I... nightmare section, which is not that bad. But also, how dare you punch me? <laughs> 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 it's rude. So well, yeah, Brian, you is... have these flesh people chasing you, trying to hug you. And, and we don't have a gun yet, right? Uh, we don't get no a weapon gun. at all. Oh, really? No, <laughs> you just, completely you not have to combat. run to the exit. Mm. You get the, a flare, but only sometimes. Yeah, the flares, um, while you're holding it, they, uh, the enemies, um, they run away. They're scared of the light. Yeah. You can also throw stuff out in the way. Yeah, and they can trip on it and shit. 
Why doesn't your flashlight scare them away? I know a flare's brighter, but I still. think it might be the heat. Oh. It's the heat or potentially the, like, UV shit. I mean, this is set in, like, late 90s, early 2000s, technically. Probably or well, close it's to the early it's, 2000s. It's the 2000s. You're using a smartphone. No, it's not. I would barely well, call it a close. smartphone. It's not a smartphone, but it's not, like... It's like a PDA. <laughs> kind of. It has a touch screen, though, so... Well, Those weren't normal not, in the 90s. Not <laughs> actually. There's a thumb pad. Is there? I could have swore it was a... Trust me, I stared at this phone for a while, slowly <laughs> trying to navigate things. There, there's a thumb pad. <laughs> All right, I'll believe you. And two buttons. It's actually more like an iPod. <laughs> <laughs> But regardless, my point is that this is not like a super bright LED flashlight, so. I don't know, it, it lights things up like it's one. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's actually one thing I want to talk about in this game. The flashlight functions like a regular flashlight. Yeah, it doesn't randomly die. Which is either. not something I can say about most horror games. <laughs> True. It's good that we touched on the car. Is this a good thing or a bad thing? Yes, it's a good thing. In most horror games, it's like a small circle on your that screen thing. that only lights up that spot. I want to talk about... Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Look at his face. It's he just looks so sinister at all times. Family is about physical affection and making your feelings... No! I don't do feelings. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, that's me. Play it because, you know, you can't talk. So I just dramatically flail do. sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't want to. Is it true to say you're a private person? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, that act that it takes a Wow! Immersion! <laughs> yeah, she actually have to shake. But I also do it sometimes People when he's not asking. Friends, but not because whatever he said was particularly egregious. <laughs> Aw, Ariel likes us more than her family. Surprising. Uh, <laughs> more th I knew I was. No. It's more that I don't like my family. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to let out your inner child and color in the picture. Ah, uh, yes. This it's part. <laughs> so, Brian, right, I'm just gonna... remember how the main game ended when we were at a house? Did it? Yes, it did. <laughs> okay. God, you're hey. so good, Cheryl. <laughs> no, trust me. Trust me, I'm not happy about this. <laughs> <laughs> this hurts me I'm more than it hurts you. You can go over the colors. You can, but I'm just like... <laughs> er Ariel. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you weren't I'm kidding. I'm very <laughs> unhappy at the amount of precision I have. <laughs> <laughs> Which is basically none. Also, I changed my mind. <laughs> you wanted to be blue instead. <laughs> <laughs> Are you just making the whole thing blue? <laughs> it's blue, Dabba Dee Dabba Da! Except for the trees. The trees get to be normal ish. Everything else is blue. Carol, you don't have to kill her every single Yes, Sunday. I do! Yes, she does! <laughs> <laughs> Even I know that! <laughs> Why? Because I got a color. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, see, there's yellow smoke. We should get that looked at. Why is there yellow smoke? <laughs> Because <laughs> I just wanted a different color there, okay? Ariel, please. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I have a blue house, and a blue car, and a blue And everything is blue for me, and myself. Also, Brian, the things you colored affect what the house looks like. Seriously? Yes, now yeah. it's blue. Well, why the hell is, is it blue? It is now. It was okay, alright. <laughs> <laughs> this is something that will be illustrated slightly more after the game breaking glitch when I color things slightly differently. 
Should, should we like date this like the before so Brian, the game breaking well, point? Hang on, hang on. <laughs> Just because I don't think Brian's understanding the story. This is supposed to be Harry's house. It's supposed to be. He thinks he's up. Yeah, it's what's on he his hears, license. But there's people in there right now. Oh, I said their clothes are blue because I made everything blue. Well, yeah. That's how are the you song okay, goes. Son? Yeah. No. <laughs> what no, we can do about that. <laughs> Cheryl! Easy there. This isn't your house. Some trouble, honey? No, Lucy. Some trouble, honey? <laughs> God, it's so this creepy that house. they just wear the well, same clothes. Well, that is not matching polos for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> They've been living here for nearly 14 years, Brian. <laughs> You're in a bad way. So Have I just been in the basement? Is this Harry Potter? <laughs> no, just just keep okay. that in mind. I was in a car accident. Keep that in mind. <laughs> in my house. It's this it's relevant. Wrong. You're starting to make a. <laughs> You're right. I'm starting to make a scene. You people are in my house. Flailing. <laughs> Here's my driver's license. <laughs> the only thing that doesn't make sense is your being here. You're upsetting my I mean, wife. Why are you doing this to no, me? She isn't the my like, daughter now is in just... there. No, like she's not. Please get off my property. Oh my yeah. god, I can hear the radio through my head. I mean it's <laughs> but still I can just sky I can just hear it. <laughs> As if it's coming from another room. Oh, Sybil got there fast. Yeah, she also doesn't wear a coat. I guess. <laughs> Aren't your boobs cold? <laughs> I'm very disturbance came through our dispatch. The address rang a bell. <laughs> yes, there's been a disturbance. There are people in my house. I think they have I my mean, daughter. And they're wearing the same shirt arrest them! <laughs> yes. Mike Stewart is a doctor. He doesn't this is, have your you This is Officer Civil Bennett. This is my Horny house. police. Let me see that light. <laughs> you had an accident. You know you're a little punch drunk, Harry. I can't raise the station on my radio. Let's go over there together and sort this mess out. Look, I'm sorry if I came across as a hard ass before. There's a lot going on right now. I just bumped you up on my priority list, okay? All right, now I'm 37. <laughs> no, I now you're like that. two. <laughs> your head. I do think it's fun. I don't remember if Brian was there for the parts where I mentioned that uh, original Bennett wears sexy Bennett pants. <laughs> and I no, he was there. Yeah, that... they both wear leather. <laughs> I find that amusing. Uh, tune in next time for an escape room on wheels. <laughs> <laughs>